Ten bucks a piece. Well, that, that, that was the, the uh, teenagers that I had, but I've already turned all of them out. So I don't I don't have any pinned up. Okay. Uh, we're, go we're going to have a sale uh, the 20th of next month out there at uh, Raymond Gilbert. Yeah. West End, you know him? No, I don't. I don't. But we're gonna have we're gonna have an auction out there uh, next month on the twentieth. Well, I'll I'll just yeah I'll just see if you have any guineas right now. I'd like to. I'd be really badass if I can have a couple. But I'll just I'll just guess those have to wait till the end of the month, end of next month. All right, buddy. I like it. Damn. Today's uh, daddy daughter day. What? I didn't take you to school. I'm taking you to work today. Is that okay? Yeah. She said she didn't want to go to school today, and I was like, eh, I'm not doing anything crazy. I was originally gonna go send some uh, rounds down range, and I was actually looking for these guineas. No, you're not going to school. You're gonna hang out with me. We're gonna do. You're gonna. Well. What are you gonna do? What was I gonna say? I was gonna say we're gonna do something fun. We're going to like the grown-up adults playground. I shouldn't put it like that. This is not a playground. That's kind of fun. That's kind of fun. It is going to be fun. Uh, but I was actually looking for some guineas. Because these guineas, these birds, they eat ticks and, and um, chiggers and all that kind of stuff inside the grass. And I was just going to let them, I was going to let them loose on my land, but I guess we're not going to be able to do that because he doesn't have any. Um, Toby bought 12. His dog ate one, so Toby's down to 11. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. What's up, Rob? How you doing? Good, buddy. How are you? I had good good news. Apparently, my engines got there last Friday. They did. Yeah. And uh, your boats are on the way. They should be here any day, if not today. You make me so. I can't curse because my daughter's in the truck. But you make me so. Yeah, well. You make me so happy. You ought to be real happy, man. <laughs> man, look at that. Okay, so you're saying that maybe today, maybe tomorrow. Okay. At any rate, as soon as they hit the ground, I'll let you know. And then, like I said, I just need a few days of plus to do service and everything. Thank you so much. Anytime. All right, bye, bye. Later, bro. What's, go what's going on back there? You're going to poke yourself in the eye with that hoof. You're going to stab yourself with that unicorn. Then you're going to be real mad. Should be fine in like three minutes. We're at... What a daddy would call his playground. So she told me uh, what's wrong with her. She is tired. I get like that too when I'm getting tired or hangry. You want to you wanna, you wanna go play around? Let's go. You're just tired, aren't you? Hello, Daddy. You want one? Hey. What is this? Baby. You want that? What is this? It's a hand grenade. What? It's a hand grenade. Wow. Yeah, you probably don't want to pull the pin. It's a rope. That is rope. What is this? It's a canteen cup. What? Canteen cup. Those flags up there. I know. Those are crazy flags, aren't they? What is this? That's a bad guy. What is this? That's a, that's a canteen. What? That's a canteen that holds water. Yes, 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 yes. Oh my goodness. But guys, guys, I found something. We're stepping on it, Daddy. I know. We're stepping on it. Try to show them. What is this? It's a hand. You ready? Yes, guys. Let's go outside now. You almost ran into the door there. What? Nothing. You like Daddy's car? Yes, yeah, nice. Come on, guys. Let's go. Right. I got the ponies and I got Fusilosia and, and Twilight Sparkle. That's what I have. Oh, what about Caden? Caden's at the house. Let's go, guys. Let's go. All right. Let's go in here. Oh, shit. We're giving a tour. What time is it? Oh, but it's time to switch. Oh, it's time to switch? Okay. Yes, yeah, time to switch. We can have Fusilosia. All right. I want to show that. They've seen this boat a lot. This is Hector's boat. It's been up here for forever. 
This is my last time. You guys will probably actually, well, you'll see this boat again here in a second. I can't wait for my new boat to come. It's gonna be fun, Avery. We got another, apparently green and black. I did not pick the color scheme on that boat, so we don't really. Hey, you wanna, you wanna go on the boat? I, want, I like boats. You like boats? You wanna go on it? I want Cam to play on. Cam will, yeah, Cam will go play with you on the boat. Cam, get your stuff. Go get, go get your uh, pony, Cam. Ah, okay. Oh, Grabbing the pony. That it's an airplane. Ah! What is that? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> it's an airplane. It's fine. We just have to do. We just have to. We just have to play so loud so we don't hear it. Okay. Okay. Hey, Priscilla. Huh? Are you? Ah, her head! Did you do that? I did. Don't do that. Come on, guys. Let's go. All right, here we go. Guys, look at Jeffo over there. Come on, guys. We're gonna do this. What? We're gonna do this. Uh, what am I doing? I want to show you the boat. The boat? No, we don't. We don't need to show him the boat. He's seen the boat. The truck. The truck. He knows the boat and the truck. All right, show me the truck. Truck. What's that? It's a truck. It's a truck? It's your dad's truck? Yeah. Really? Does this well, open? He's standing right there. He is? Ah, Uh-oh. What's her names? Uh, Twilight and... I'm just, gonna, I'm just gonna walk to the front and just let her do her thing. I can't see her eyes. Alright, Avery, we're gonna show him the truck real quick, because I know there's probably a lot of people that clicked on this video to watch a truck be shown. Um, so you want to do this? You want to do it real quick? It'll take a second. You got this? Mm. Okay. I don't want to do it. Okay, then I'll do it. And you can just watch. Do you? Okay, you go. Let's okay, do I it. got this. Cam, Daddy's gonna do it. Oh, yes. Daddy. Okay. I'm gonna got this. You ready? One, two, three. Hey, welcome over here to Lunkers TV, everybody. I'm glad you guys have enjoyed this video so far. This is an F-250. I told myself back in probably I think it was October-ish. Yeah, this is a truck. Back in October, when I saw that these things were coming out, I'm like, I'm gonna get one of those. But they've came out and they have had absolutely zero rebates on these things whatsoever. Literally, they've been way too expensive for me to want to go purchase one. I think the average price right now in Texas in DFW is 76 grand for this one. For this one. And I didn't really feel like paying $76,000 for a truck. I did pay 68,000 for this thing. You know why? Because it has hail damage, which I'm gonna show you real quick. Look at this. There's a, a little thing right there. I know that they said that there was two and I can only see this one. Uh, so there's that, that's it. Uh, and that's actually getting fixed on Monday, that little tiny thing. But they're selling to me for $68,000. The people over Bill Utter Ford in, in, in Denton. And I found it online, I was like, zing, I'm taking that thing. It's about, it's uh, $8,000 cheaper than the other ones. It cost me $0 down because I had equity in my other truck and it cost me legitimately the exact same monthly payment. I was like, new truck, Pfft, let's do it to it. Lemon peasy, I get to move everything into one truck. Ain't that right, Avery? And then we got a camera in the front, which Avery's been talking about. You wanna show them the camera? There's a camera right there in the front. That's for, I can see when I'm off-roading, if I'm gonna run into a tree or not, or a bush, and when I'm parking. And it's got 360 views. It's got stuff on this, what's that? That says Ford. Anyway, I got it from this people, you know, Bill, Bill Utter. Bill Utter, Mr. Utter. I got it from a guy named Phil over there, really nice guy. Probably the easiest car buying experience I've ever had in my life. That's so if I get stuck. So what's cool about these ones, uh, they, they're made for off-roading. So when I, when I built that Bison, I built it for off-roading, or oh, not, excuse me, excuse me, re retract, retract, retract. I didn't build it for off-roading. I built it for camping and doing all that kind of stuff out in the woods. And ironically enough, I ended up getting that sent down to me. And that thing is actually way more feasible than driving out there and setting up the tent. I literally can set that up and then drive. It made, after doing it for a little bit, I realized that's really the way to go. But this thing comes with the exact same tires my other one have. These are the, the best things ever. These Goodyear uh, Wranglers, I've had no issues with them. They're not loud. They're amazing. These are 35s. I think those are 20 inch rims. I don't really know. It doesn't really matter to me. One thing I will say I wanted, I did want the, uh, I want that to be folded up, but that doesn't come with these ones. It comes with like the Platinum and the King Ranch and I got the Lariat. Anyway, that's the, uh, that's the same thing as a Raptor. The same Raptor steps. What else should we show on cam? Oh, I forgot to say this is a trimmer edition. This is not just a normal, which you'll see here in a little bit. The inside's nice. The windows are getting tinted on Monday. The bed liner's getting done on Monday. And I have rubber mats coming right now. 
You want to get in and show them? You want to turn it on? You don't want to turn it on? I think they upgraded these engines as well. I think they're pushing about a little over a thousand foot pounds of torque now, which is significant. Um, it's quiet. Sounds like a Ford F-250. Ah, what am I doing? We're just pushing the buttons. So another reason why Cam and I were having a conversation about maybe switching out is we have no room in the other truck. We had none. And a lot of times he's editing while we're driving. We're trying to do stuff. This one has an AC thing in the front, which is great because he can charge his uh, laptop. Uh, it's got a different differential in it. We can lock the diff, but it's got a different differential than the regular F-250s. It's got a, I think it's a lower geared one. It also has a mode, the creeping mode, which is another reason why I wanted it. Basically, you can push this thing, let go of, or get, off, get your foot off the gas, and it'll literally drive for you up the hill, other than steering, of course. But it's got a cool little button here. You just push that, and you can see all around you. What yeah. are you doing? Look, I can see these little camera views that Dad actually has never pushed yet. Oh, I didn't know that was a view. There's my, wow, did you know? I didn't know that was there. That's cool. Yeah, it's got views like this, 360 view. Oh, and then it's got this thing, this trailer backup thing that Cam actually needs uh, significantly. So, you know how sometimes you, when you, you're new to driving and you have to back up a trailer? Yeah. So this trailer backup thing is actually fairly, it's new, I guess. I've never actually used one, um, but it's gonna be, if you're not really good at backing up a trailer. I, know, I, didn't, I didn't see the camera. Oh, you wanna see the camera? Look. So you, uh, when you back up the trailer, you actually turn this knob which way you want the trailer to go and does it turn the wheel for you? Mm -hmm. It turns the wheel for you. So if you're not really good at backing up trailers, you literally just turn this knob, I guess, and it'll back the trailer up for you, which is kind of, which is kind of cool. And then it's got this. If you want to push this button right here. Yes, yes, me. Yeah, push that button. Can you reach it? Can you reach it? Ah. See. Look at that. See. That's pretty big. Let's push it one more time. There you go. See, you guys. It's cool, huh? Yeah, it's very cool when I look at the window right there. Yeah, it looks at the window. Then it's got all the auxiliary, auxiliary, auxiliary switches Guys, you need. Guys, I can see the fan up there. Yeah, you can see the fan. What else? I'll go ahead and turn this off. I love this feature. That's the nicest thing ever for me. Daddy, that can move. I know, that, it's crazy. Oh, I'll play with the cameras here in a little bit. You want to show them the stuff in the back? Uh, yeah. Okay. Let's put your right, come here. They're right here. Cam's on that side. I want to go in. Okay. So another, another really awesome reason why I wanted ouch. to get, what's ouch, that? Ouch, I said ouch. I don't know what, okay. So it's got another AC outlet in the back. Um, another AC outlet and then it's got a bunch of charging ports. It's actually got the new iPad or iPod thing there, plus the USB. When you, when you charge your phone right there. Yeah, you charge your phone right there. And then you, and then you put, and then you put your cups right yeah, there. Yeah, all your chocolate milk. Yeah, and then you put, and then you put two cups holes. In. Yeah, two cup holes. And but, uh, what there's else? There's another cup hole right there. There's a couple cup holes. Oh, yeah, this is cool. Cam, flip that side up. <gasps> oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness, it's cool. This is kind of cool. So, this to me is a huge, huge, huge thing. I have a shovel. I have an axe. I have my come-alongs. Well, I have chains. I have two tow ropes, two tow Literally, well, totally I, want, I want to sit right there. I no, like... not, not when it's up. It's crazy, silly goose. Uh, I got jacks. I literally can fit everything inside this guys, one compartment. Guys, in my... guys, guys, guys. You... What do you want to tell them? Why do you have this thing right Why do I have this? This is just in case we get hurt and I got to clog up your blood so you don't bleed out. I always keep I that kind of stuff. I got tourniquets something. and everything in this truck. I got everything guys, in this truck. Yes, Avery. We have, we have to put your phone there when you put that out. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, in the front, I forgot to show you guys, it has a, like a charging base, so you just throw your phone on it. So you can no, plug it in. Here, this big area right there. It's a big area, I know. So with the other truck, you guys remember I had, I had to put all this stuff inside of the black, um, that, what are those, what are the containers on the, on the back of the truck? All the stuff was inside there. Yeah, I know, that's cool. And now it's pretty much in here. I, I was thinking about putting a, uh, a toolbox, but a toolbox ruins the bed of your truck and it just, it just, it takes up space. Yeah. Well, that's pretty neat. You want to go in now? What? So right now it does not have clearly any bed liner, but that'll be done on Monday. Um, I know you can see in. It's inside. Uh, it's got lights back here as well, which are pretty neat. The King Ranches and the Platinums have an AC outlet back here. I'm trying to think of like all the difference. The thing is, if you guys are looking to like, I like I like buying. I like buying deals. I like finding deals. Wow. That's why I waited. King Ranches and the Platinums, you're basically paying for 
on a platinum you're playing for it's a it's the exact same thing as a lariat maybe with a plug-in in the back and extra chrome badging for ten thousand dollars extra king ranches you get different colored leather same trucks you just i don't know maybe i might be cheap i know there's probably a lot of you guys right now rob you're not cheap you have all these all this stuff in here well i don't i don't know this is my job ken what do you, do you think this is a good deal i thought oh, it was yeah, a pretty it's damn it's good, deal. good deal no money down same payments Oh yeah, how do you work this one? Oh, I should take that off. What is that? That's the, I don't know. Yeah, this is for when dad gets older, because it's gonna happen. What is this? This is a, this is for when, oh yeah, when you get those jorts, you know, like down here, it's real tough, tough on me. So I gotta like use this to get into the truck. It's pretty nifty. You like it? Can I get in the truck? Yeah, I don't, I don't get back to it very often though. I don't need it right now. I will. I'll put stuff in here. I will. I'll put a lot of stuff. You'll have toys and... Actually, you don't need any more toys. Oh, uh oh I want to show them the underneath the truck because I haven't actually looked underneath. I wonder if I can get under there. Avery, you want to get out? Hey, let's grab these 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 things right there, Avery. Because remember, I told you guys, maybe you might be new to the channel, you don't know this. I used to sell Fords before I did YouTube right after I was out of the military. I went from military, sold Fords for about a year, and then started doing YouTube. And that's what I know a little bit about, like what you get on the packages. I'm so picky on trying to find them. But I will say, even with me selling Fords, that was the easiest car deal I've ever done in my life over at that dealership. That, that, that was crazy. I just like bleep myself out, you hear that? Avery, just don't go past the tailgate, okay? Uh, now the big thing with this is gonna have different suspension. It's gonna have skid plates on the bottom of it, kind of like the Bison did. I think it has skid plate on the transfer case, on the rear diff, maybe, I don't know what's, I'm gonna actually have to look. Yeah, there's a skid plate going all the way across. Yeah, look, transmission's got one. The different, or the, excuse me, the transfer case's got one. You know what else is nice about Fords? The depth tank isn't dragging the ground like a, like a Chevy. But see, look, yeah, so you can tell it has different shocks and suspension. You can see it says trimmer on it. A lot of you guys already know what this is. It's six, seven. It looks like an engine to me. It looks like an area of the, the truck that I don't want to stick my hands in because it's so damn cramped. Apparently they made these things a bit better than when they first came out in, what was it, 07 or 06 or something like that. Um, six, seven is a beast. What, oh, they, I saw they did something different on the back. I'll show you this. So on the other ones, they didn't have... Another camera. It's the crazy, camera. huh? There's two cameras? There's two cameras. Crazy, huh? Daddy, you can, you can see in a truck when you get crashed by a window. Well, I hope I don't get crashed in my window. So... When you, no, when you crash somebody's window. I'm not crashing anybody's window. When, no, when, when you back up. Oh, okay. When you back up. The, I, know, I know on the when other you ones... back up like that, like a truck. Yeah, I'll back up like a truck. I know that they used to just have the Ford M and Alex as a Super Duty. This is a good best of this. You know what? Matter of fact, Daddy, I think this, this is, yeah, look at this. Avery, hold on back up. Oh my up. goodness, this is wet on here. I bet it, wow. Daddy, what are you doing? I was, I just re realized it was on there. And you can also start the truck from here, which is pretty, pretty Daddy, normal mode. You read? Oh, you want me to shut it? That's pretty much that's pretty much the deal. Traded in my truck. Didn't have to make any money down. Didn't have to do anything. Didn't have any payments for 60 days. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Oh, you know what else they fixed on them? I hope. Yeah, they did. So on the other ones and on the Chevys, that you wouldn't be able to hook up a boat very easily to that. I have to actually get like a um, I forget what they're called. That U-shaped thing you stick the bolt nut through. Anyway, you just had to hang that off. That's pretty neat. Thank God. Finally, there you go. That's me. You guys are looking for deals on trucks, do what I did. Just be patient. Wait. Find one like, like this. Really, it's fully loaded as you could possibly get. And I got it for $8,000 cheaper than any other truck I could find in the New Metroplex because of a tiny little ding that's getting fixed on Monday. Unless you guys don't have ale where you live, that kind of stuff. No, we don't need to get the boots. But I hope you guys did enjoy this video over here on Lunkers TV. I will catch you guys on another episode. Avery, you want to kick us off? You want to say goodbye? No, don't pick your nose. Bye bye. Thank <laughs> you.